In tonight's Health Team 9 Medical Beat, we take a closer look at LASIK, following a review of complaints about the common vision correction procedure. An advisory committee is encouraging doctors to talk with their patients about the risks and side effects. Our medical reporter Melissa Eichmann spoke with a local doctor about the proposed warnings, and she has some tips for patients considering the procedure. Andy Bogini has had vision problems since the third grade. I'm tired of wearing contact lenses. His decision to get LASIK has been seven years in the making, and it comes in the midst of a call for more awareness. The warnings are in response to 140 complaints by patients. That's out of about six million procedures performed. Uh, dry eye was at the top of the list uh, following LASIK. Uh, patients who had glare, starburst, halos, and there were some very tragic cases that were thrown in. Dr. Stephen Uptograf with Uptograf Vision in St. Petersburg performs up to 60 LASIK procedures a week. He says while the risks are there, if patients are carefully screened, problems are rare. And what I find is many times these patients, they've had a perfectly good LASIK, but they weren't educated about dry eye and how to treat it so that they could get out of this dry eye cycle, I call it. And, and live a normal life. Andy says he's confident with his decision. When they tell you that they're going to, you know, use a, a blade or a laser to cut a flap off of your eye, to me it's, it's relatively uh, straightforward that there are some risks involved. Dr. Ebdegraff says as with any procedure, it's important that patients know the benefits, the risks, and that they ask a lot of questions. Like, is the surgeon a corneal specialist? What type of technology do they use? How many procedures have they performed? And make sure to discuss your history with contact lenses and your motivation for getting LASIK. If there's any question of, of is something gray zone, you know, then it needs to not be done. It's elective. Andy's procedure went well, and he says he has a lot to look forward to. If I want to go play golf, I can go play golf. In St. Petersburg with your Health Team 9 Medical Beat, Melissa Eichmann, Bay News 9. Health Team 9 has more medical news and links for you at baynews9.com. You just click on the health link that you'll find on the left of the screen. There you can learn more about LASIK. And you'll find all the day's health headlines. Plus, check out the pollen forecast. It's all in our health page.